and we're live. So I have a story uh, I, to yeah. tell. That does sound funny. I'll check that out. I mean, I almost didn't bring it up, but I want to. All right. So this is a little sensitive because it's real life. It's current and it involves my neighbors. But um, my neighbors have a German shepherd and it's aggressive. That much just true. Like um, some of the issues that it causes for us is like when we take our trash out down to the curb, German shepherd comes running down the street up right at like two feet from you and aggressively barks. And I try to like alpha it, you know, like bad, sit down, whatever. It's not working. I've tried just looking the other way, but I feel very much like he's going to jump me. And mm -hmm. uh, it, it would be easy to underestimate just how aggressive he appears. I know he hasn't mm -hmm. bit me yet, but you know, the hair's up on his oh, back. He's oh, really oh, at you. Lunging. It's a full fledged lunging. 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 Yeah, yeah. Pepper and spray. if I walk away, he's coming at me. It's That's actually a good idea. But, um, but there's more. So uh he, he's done this to me multiple times as i get the trash and it's not like he's out there it's like you get the trash and he comes out and yeah. not out of nowhere he comes from a thousand feet down the street just at me yeah. and uh last time i got the trash i literally like ran away on the golf cart and he starts chasing me on the golf cart <laughs> you um, gotta pepper spray that dog i like that but let me keep going so uh uh anyway there's been other episodes where like we just open our kitchen door right and you have to understand we're like 1500 feet from them right this dog yeah. has come all the way across our property into our backyard at our kitchen door to where my wife feels like she can't leave our house and that's mm -hmm. when she lets the great danes out and whatever but um is he, he scared just, of them he run, uh well at first he ran and then they started making friends so <laughs> <laughs> that's <laughs> that <Shit. laughs> yeah damn it so uh uh, which, you know, isn't the worst result if it resulted in him like being friendly with us. But that hasn't happened. There's been another time where she felt trapped in her car because the dog was like waiting for her as, the, as she pulled dog. in. And now she's like stuck in her car until this dog leaves. After I ran from him on the golf cart, he stayed there like guarding our yard. I mean, it's not his territory. It's mine. But he just stayed there and wouldn't let us go. So I talked to the neighbors and, uh, you know, I just knocked on the front door and I was like, I got to talk to you about your dog. And, uh, I tried to be super cool about it. And I explained like, look, I've had an aggressive dog before. Like I get this, you know, I, I understand like sometimes dogs just, they're not easily chilled, you know, but I was like, we kept our dog on a leash and we gave our dog a muzzle because we knew it was dangerous. You let your dog come at us. Like th this is impacting us in our kitchen door. And she, she just kept saying, like, it's okay. You know, or no, okay, okay. Like, I get it. And uh, I was like, you know, like, it, I get it more than she said, oh, we're going to have the dog trained. I was like, we tried that too. I, I'm still nervous. I, like, you walk your dog and you don't keep your dog on a leash. So he zips across our front yard. And you have to understand, it's like 200 yards into the front yard. It's not like he's yeah. on the corner or something. And I'm like, that's one thing when it was your other dog. They had a really sweet chocolate lab. But with this one, like, you know, we don't like him running across like our property. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I, I was, I said, next time I take the trash out, I'm going to have to bring a gun. Like I've never killed anything like except for a squirrel. But what am I, I didn't even think of pepper spray, but I'm like, this is a dog that's giving me every warning. You know, it, it, if you so much as if I see you, I'm coming for you. That's what this dog does. And, uh, and I get it. We've had an aggressive dog, but we thought this aggressive dog was like a huge responsibility, something we needed to protect everyone. Like Kyle, you came over. Did you ever see that dog without a muzzle? No, nah, you took care of me. You have to, or, you know, like Jackie would walk at night and stuff, but it was leash and muzzle. And like that, that was the deal. Like you couldn't have that. They don't leash their dog. They don't, they seem to keep them outside. You know, because whenever I, he spots me, I've been me, mauled terribly without your protection. That was the situation. <laughs> that I, I think I'm gonna be. Like, I really think there's a. So, first thing I would do, um, I would call the police, and I would. Uh, you need to start the paperwork now. You know, like it's just like a domestic abuse situ scenario. Like the best way to actually get results and to protect yourself in a future potential legal issue is to have like a paper trail. Like, like so, I would start that as soon as possible. I would report this aggressive dog. And uh, like, like let and get that on paper and in the system immediately. Not that neighborly, and, though. I kind of like that I talk to them. Well, you're about to shoot your dog with pepper spray. Like that's going to happen this week. So like it's it, they're going to be mad about that because he's going to return home all orange and 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 whipped. Um, uh, last time somebody pepper sprayed one of my dad's dogs, like 
like threatened to whip their ass and, and called the Georgia Power Company and told them never to send that son of a bitch back. And granted, this guy pepper sprayed a Jack Russell Terrier. Yeah. Okay. This is a German absurd. Shepherd. Yeah, anyway. this this was a twelve pound dog that was yipping <laughs> at a grown fucking man, and he pepper sprayed it. So like, we were warranted in our ass now, whooping threat. I should mention, I think I can take this dog, but it shouldn't. I will get very hurt in the scuffle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it yeah. won't kill you, but, but want, it's going to be a. Mark. I want a lopsided victory if there's going to be a battle. Dude, get yeah, the you do not want a Pyrrhic victory. You <laughs> want a decisive it like, victory. <laughs> it feels like a perfect opportunity to review bear traps. Just place yeah. them and have like different brands for a YouTube, <laughs> for a YouTube video. No, I, what, what I really want is for them just to leach the dog. That would they're be the ideal scenario. And I don't think that. they're going to do that. And it'll be fun to pepper spray the dog, I promise you. Yeah, you, you, I, I, if it were me, I would get the bear spray because it comes in a big container. It has a, it has a big wide, it's got a big wide spread. It's got a nice <laughs> spread. Um, and it's got range. You can fog the dog down if you need to because with the squirty ones that like you would deal with a man who's like in your face and get him that way like you might miss or you might not you might hit a part of the dog that's not sensitive to it uh but but you fucking hit him once with that he'll leave you the fuck alone because it's it's gonna fuck his I day i think up. i'm gonna buy that like right now we can keep it in the cup holder on the golf cart because that's yeah, when absolutely. there's no escape like if yeah. you open the back door and you see the thing running from 500 feet away then there's time you know you can deal with it um but when you're like already a thousand feet away I, I felt like i had nowhere to go and when i tried to alpha the dog he was he was just more motivated. Like that yeah. didn't work out Have at all. Have you filmed it? Is that proof? No, but they see it. They've seen it, and they've no, called, I mean, called the their dog if back. They try and say something. No, to you. And, and this last time, I think they saw it. I, I'm I, I'm falsely accusing them, maybe, but it seemed like as soon as the incident ended, she opened the door and let the dog back in. <laughs> and I'm like, was she just? Because last time, I I. I talked to them from afar. It wasn't like I yelled at them or anything, but I was like, like, this isn't okay. Like the, like, your dog is, is aggressive towards us. Like you need to leash it. And then the next time it happened, they weren't there until I left. And then instantly they opened the door and let the dog in. I'm like, I, in my head, they witnessed it all go down, but they didn't want to talk to me about it. Yeah. Which is why you I also there. tased the dog, which would be, that be sounds risky. Fun. I don't know. I that'd, be hard, that'd be harder. Nah, right. it'd be harder to, to pull And you off. need yeah, aim sure. and, and stuff. I, oh, you get a couple tasers, you start wielding those bitches. You know? <laughs> and the but cool he, thing about the taser, right after, right? there's one called the jogger, and uh, mm -hmm. it's, it's pink, and you shoot and then just drop the thing and run. But you could shoot and then start whooping the dog's ass with a stick as the dog is like immobilized, <laughs> like, like twitching on the ground. You like get on him and alpha him, like, like start smacking him around while he can't do anything a little bit, maybe piss on him. That send the message oh, okay. home. Okay, all right. Yeah. So this is taking a turn. Well, <laughs> I mean, hey, you, this, this is dog. This is dog world. I'm now. glad we're, you came up with the bear spray idea because I was literally I went straight to shotgun, yeah. and I all you have to see how this goes down. The dog's running at you in a no, full gallop, right? Yeah. All the way until he's like 18 inches from me, and then he's just sort of lunging, snapping, all the, everything but biting, and it's like, so when do you shoot? Right, because we already know the dog might just. Oh, uh, my dad hard. would have already shot. Yeah. yeah, if it's sprinting at you, gnashing its teeth, I think you're justified. And I'm well, telling you, man, like I, I'd have, I think I'd have already shot too. Like, like I, I'm not gonna deal with that. Like, not from some strange dog on my property who's like charging at me and like fur up, like doing that bark where every bark is like a lunge forward and snap kind of yeah, thing. Like, yeah, like my dog does that to me, but like. I can't do anything about it, right? You know? <laughs> yeah. That motherfucker bit me, you know, a couple months ago. My, the bruise is just now, like, the, is going away. It, it was awful. And he that was a pretend bite. He could have <laughs> ripped my calf off if he really desired to do so. Like, German Shepherds are, you know, they're working dogs. That that, that dog's meant to bite people. And in, I, I want to have regard. a good relationship with this neighbor. I don't want to always be the guy that killed their dog, you know? I, I'm sure <laughs> to the family, this is a loving dog. Because to our family, Jack was a loving dog. Yeah. You know, he was snuggly to us. Our kid, Colin, would smack him away when he didn't want him nearby. Uh, did, did he pass away? Colin? Yeah, he had a heart attack a couple of years ago. And uh, but um, this dog, like, I'm not part of his family, and he's and it, it maybe I'm being territorial, and my reptilian brain is going. But I really don't like that he comes a thousand feet at me onto my okay. property. Like he, 
I'm not on his land. I'm not even in open land. This is my spot. Why is your dog running loose in my yard? Yeah, no, you're right. You're exactly yeah. right. That's yeah. not exactly Are you guaranteed to be safe if you spray him? Yeah. Oh, yeah. 100%? Oh, yeah. Could, could oh, he be yeah. even more pissed the next day? No. No. Okay, 18 he's inches, going to two he's inches. going to realize that he that he fucked with, with with a human being who had like who had something he'd never experienced before like Wizardry. i'm just this is a little bit of speculation here but I, i've been pepper sprayed i can tell you it it, it t- takes all the fucking fight out of you blinds you and incapacitates you but for an animal with such a powerful sense of smell you gotta think that it hurts him more a little oh, bit yeah. right i didn't think of that i would you think know? so Maybe I, I don't know. It, it's Just gonna him hurt him misting. at least the same amount it hurts me, and that's a whole fucking hell of a lot. It's the same for bears because bears are people. Yeah, bears are people too, <laughs> and it works on them. And, and I mean, it, it, the shit's called bear mace. I, you know, it, it comes in a. You know, you've got like a pistol grip and the container I just comes down. It, it was thirty dollars. It wasn't a joke, yeah. but it's worth it. Yeah, worth it. You've got a fog that lasts for a while. Aren't it's I gonna get a, sprayed? Like it's gonna be yeah, a little windy. You're down wind from it, like and it's blowing right back in your face. Then yeah, but you know, maybe give it a test squeeze outside and see what happens. Mm-hmm. You know, when you're when you're encountering the dog, maybe give it a little ch-ch-ch, like no, no, test no, no. it I, and be like, all right. I just thought of the perfect idea. You go on your power motor and you just start cropping the fields. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go above. around their their uh, garden or something. I like this idea because I was honestly, I uh, my only idea was the gun. And I don't yeah. want to hurt any like, dogs. I like dog. I love dogs. I've got three dogs, and I like neighbors. And and like I want this all to be okay, but I'm repeatedly being accosted on my own property. Yeah, pepper spray that bitch. It'll be great. I'd love it if you recorded it with your cell phone and let us watch too. That sounds like a lot to manage. Yeah. <laughs> oh, GoPro. GoPro, GoPro up, man. Put the GoPro by the by, uh, by the, with the golf cart with the bear spray. Put that show. Put that chest harness on. Just like paintball. Oh, mount the GoPro. To the bear mace. That way you're one button press away from a real fucking great video. <laughs> you got 100,000 views on that? No problem. It's been a lock lately for how often the dog attacks me. Unless the conversation bear fixed aggressive it. aggressive dog. Aggressive Dude. problem dog. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I don't want this problem, but I've got it. So here we are. Rabbit. The, we, hopefully Question we got the mark? bear mace by Monday. I think that's trash night. <laughs> Awesome. I'm looking forward to this. This will be good. The dog is always get... outside. Yeah, fuck that dog. I... Yeah. I'd be worried for the children. Uh, yes, absolutely. Jackie said that too. She, she says, you know, like, you know, if you're just out there with yourself, I don't know if you have to bring a shotgun, but if it's you and Colin, like you've got to. And yeah. there's and, a certain and by logic. The way, like airsoft or paintball would, would whip his ass too. You know, like, like he won't like that. Yeah, except that they might attack. Right? Have to keep it charged. I don't have any way to put Aaron in airsoft. No, they won't attack. No, I'm, I'm telling you, they're not. They're not. They're not ready for that. 